the Duchess of Sussex relived the heart-wrenching moment she was told the news on the long-awaited first episode of her podcast, which was released today, Tuesday. She described how the incident had left helpers shaken and in tears. She added, as a mother, you go, oh, my God, what? Speaking to friend and tennis star Serena Williams on Archetypes, Megan explained she had been visiting Nyanga, a predominantly black suburb of Cape Town, with Prince Harry in 2019. Megan said, The moment we landed, we had to drop, Archie, off at this housing unit that they had had us staying in. He was going to get ready to go down for his nap. We immediately went to an official engagement in this township called Nyanga. And there was this moment where I'm standing on a tree stump and I'm giving this speech to women and girls. The Duchess continued, We finish the engagement, we get in the car and they say Therese been a fire at the residence. There's been a fire in the baby's room. We get back, and our amazing nanny Lauren is in floods of tears. She was supposed to put Archie down for his nap and she just said, You know what? Let me just go get a snack downstairs. She added, in that amount of time that she went downstairs, the heater in the nursery caught on fire. There was no smoke detector. Someone happened to just smell smoke down the hallway, went in, fire extinguished. He was supposed to be sleeping in there. The eventful September trip was the first the couple had shared since the birth of Archie Harrison and saw the Duke and Duchess meet anti-apartheid activist Bishop Desmond Tutu. Their visit to Nyanga was to meet with the Justice Desk, a group that teaches self-defense and empowerment to vulnerable children, many of whom have suffered trauma. Megan told Ms. Williams, as a mother, you go, oh, my God, what? Everyone's in tears, everyone's shaken. And what do we have to do? Go out and do another official engagement. The Duchess recounted asking if they could tell people what had happened but they decided not to as the focus ends up being on how it looks instead of how it feels. She said, part of the humanizing and the breaking through of these labels and these archetypes and these boxes that we're put into is having some understanding on the human moments behind the scenes that people might not have any awareness of and to give each other a break. Because we did we had to leave our baby.